Good for Business is sponsored by Washington Federal Bank. Call us, Wafed Bank. Good Thursday morning to you, Brad. Good here with your Good for Business report. Well, Amazon could become the exclusive home for Thursday night football. The Wall Street Journal reports the NFL is close to signing new deals with broadcasters as well as Amazon. It could become what they're talking about could be the, the sole streaming device for, uh, the, for the NFL could become that for Thursday night, just the NFL matchups, excuse me. The journal says the deals could be in place as early as next week. It will be pricey. The networks could have to cough up double their current rate. These deals include one with Amazon, wouldn't take effect until after the 2022 season. Well, here's a housing twist. Single women saw about twice as much growth in home purchases as single men. That's according to research from Redfin at the end of last year. Single women purchased 8.7% more homes in the fourth quarter than a year earlier. That's a larger increase in single men who purchased 4.6% more homes during that same time period. This happened even through the economic slowdown brought on by the pandemic forced women out of the workforce at a greater rate than men. While that housing market continues to boom, many investors on Wall Street remain bullish on a full economic recovery with green shoots popping up everywhere as the country reopens. On the job front, claims for first-time unemployment came in lower last week than expected, even after those harsh winter storms shut down many parts of the country. We get the Labor Department's monthly jobs report for February tomorrow morning. It's expected to show 210,000 new jobs created. The caveat to further stock gains is that some on Wall Street are spooked by inflation creeping higher, and that could put pressure on stocks. Checking in on the markets, it looks like a turnaround from two days of losses. As we wait to see what the jobs report tomorrow tells us about the recovery, stocks were up on the Dow about 150 points just five minutes ago, and now we're back to that flat line, up about five points in early trade. Be good to yourselves. That's good for business. Powered by Wafed Bank.